this is the story of how I met my husband and um, actually a lot of people in our real life don't know the entire story because for some reason I think that we're both slightly embarrassed about it and um, especially at the time when we met I think it was just kind of weird um, but I'm gonna tell you guys the story and if anyone in my personal life comes across my channel surprise this is how Mike and I originally met so we met back in 2005 and I had moved here from um, where I grew up and I was living in a new town I didn't know anybody and um, kind of sucked I was kind of lonely so I was going to be starting college and this was the era of my space back in 2005 so I think it was like maybe a week or two after I had moved here that I was checking out MySpace and um, just looking around at people that were, uh, I think you could type in like areas and stuff like that. And um, so I typed in like the town that my school was in and, you know, just kind of looking and seeing what the people here did and what kind of people went to that school and stuff like that. So um, I came across Mike's profile and his picture, I wish I had a picture to show you guys, but that picture is long gone because it was on a computer that died. But anyway, his picture caught my eye <laughs> because he's 6'4", and it was a picture of him, super duper tall, standing next to this teeny tiny little Japanese lady, and I thought it was so funny. He was probably like, I don't know, two feet taller than her or something. And I just thought it was cute. So I clicked on his profile and he uh, went to the same school that I was about to start. So I was like, okay, that's really cool. And I sent him a message. And so we met on MySpace, which is the embarrassing part. <laughs> and I think it's less embarrassing now um, because people meet online all the time. I mean, I'm on YouTube. I've met people from YouTube and it's, you know, I don't know. But I think back in 2005, it was still kind of like, Ooh, you met someone online that's really weird so plus they were both 18 and now having Charlotte if she wanted to like go meet someone that she met online when she was an 18 year old girl in a town she just moved to I'd be a little iffy about that but um I, we didn't tell either one of our parents so <laughs> um and we did both still live at home with our parents so we messaged back and forth for a few days and we chatted on um AOL Instant Messenger and he was just so adorable and um, so we decided to meet. I was going to be having um, orientation and so I was like will you meet me at the school and you know I thought it was kind of a neutral ground we were both going to that school anyway and uh, so we met at the school and he was so cute he was like shy and um, just adorable and so we walked around and he gave me a tour of the school which I thought was really cute and we just had a great time it was like we instantly clicked and our personality is just really meshed and we totally hit it off so um, we decided to go on our first real date I think it was like a couple days later and um, yeah we have been together ever since that was uh, seven years ago so that was in April of 2005 so um, the story that we actually tell people of how we met is just that we met at school which is you know technically we did meet in person for the first time at school but um, really we met on MySpace so kind of embarrassing but now you guys know the real story of how I met my husband and um, I'm curious how you guys met your significant others so do a video response or post down below because I always love hearing stories of how people met each other. I think it's really cute.